friends here i am uh, checking this sm is repairing now i am repairing this sm is here serial bug correction so once uh, glowing and off means uh, problem in the secondary smps uh, problem in secondary so, so i want to connect uh, this uh, Okay, I will check with the Removing screws. This is the primary section. This section is good because the light to glow and that is why a problem in that is not not in this secondary side. These are the secondary side. 12 voltage, 5 voltage, 3.3, minus 12 and 5, minus 5 all this voltage is generated here only so we have to check here so mostly problem with uh, this here we have to check physically first we have to check physically if these diodes are very nice so this capacitor also nice one this capacitor is bad because it bulged this one this one this one three capacitors are not good so this is uh, this is also good this is also good uh, mostly problem with uh, these three three capacitors if we change this capacitors problem will be rectified i will uh, change this uh, capacitor i will check uh, with this uh, Okay, which is uh, faulty. First, we have to check uh, capacitors physically. We can easily find uh, if uh, capacitor is fault. We can easily find. When we are removing this, we have to remember the polarity of the capacitor. For this here minus the negative this is positive for this capacitor value is uh, 1000 mf 10 volt okay again this also I have to remove 
here also this uh, three capacitors uh, in this uh, field uh, so I want to replace uh, this uh, three capacitors now with uh, new ones when we replacing this uh, capacitors we have to remember where is the polarity check check first polarity and then replace it here that indication shows this is a negative this one is positive so here I am replacing here one capacitor same value 1000 mf uh, uh, 10 voltage Third capacitor I replacing. First, we when we replacing this uh, uh, capacitors, we have must and should check the polarity correct. Otherwise, it will blast. So next video, I am uh, how to check this uh, defected capacitors. Also, I will show in next video. Now present, I am uh, just uh, troubleshooting this uh, SMPS secondary problem SMPS through series bulb so now it's completed we also check this uh, th three diodes uh, uh, this also is there any uh, is there any uh, die solder or anything we have to check uh, physically then uh, after that we can close here so it is uh, perfectly okay any have one more time I will uh, solder is there any fault in that by this also the power secondary power will not come okay now perfectly okay okay perfectly okay I said uh, I have three capacitors and uh, and checked uh, uh, die solders also in this circuit now it's uh, very fine you know it's uh, replaced capacitors here one two three replaced and uh, see so now I am fixing Now I am fixing. After fixing this, we have to check once. This SMPS, which is repaired. Now fan also some little bit. Uh, okay, it's also nice. Now I am. Uh, this uh, serial bulb test through this <clears throat> okay now i connected mm. Now it's okay. SMPS is running. 
very fine so motor is uh, some little difference i i am turned to this uh, dc voltage range 20 volt and then uh, i have checking middle pin uh, ground and uh, yellow pin is plus 12 yes 12 we are getting 12 and uh, red pin uh, 5 okay everything is going working in this orange 3.3 volt and this uh, we can check minus voltage also press 5 okay everything is very nice because here uh, the pin is uh, broken that is why it's uh, not working now i replacing this uh, new bulb with uh, here so here we can see see when smps is good the time uh, this uh, uh, light will glow okay now it's uh, okay and so i make this uh, for uh, direct connection for uh, when we preparing for direct connection okay uh, thank you please subscribe my video please